video, wait, let me welcome you first. Hi, I'm Sydney, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, put that, hit that subscribe button, thumbs up, all that good stuff. Anyway, yesterday's video was very artsy, travel, vacation with me and my husband. Today, I'm hyper, and I'm way more hyper than I was yesterday. The level of content just swap. I'm, this is why I don't have a sense of style or like a theme on my channel because my mind is just like all I'm saying is you know. So it's actually already like six o'clock so why am I starting this video? Well I have something important that I want to talk to you guys about which is the title of this video but I thought you know that's boring to just sit there and talk so I'm gonna vlog the rest of the day and talk to you guys about baby fever. Before we continue with today's video, I have to tell you guys about today's sponsor, which is me. I'm today's sponsor because I just designed new merch that is dropping in one week. June 28th, we will have a faux fam summer line and it includes a new logo that will now be on all of the couples channel videos. And my next video I post, I have a bunch of really big announcements, so don't forget to subscribe and follow my Instagram, Sid Forsyth, for more information. And I'll be talking about the merch more on there and all that kind of stuff. I don't know what it is, it's like, I've wanted to be a mom my whole life and ever since I've gotten married like this is like the second time I've had like intense baby fever since I've been married and I've only been married for five months so that's like that's a lot that's a that's too many times especially considering we want to wait five years and I still agree with that I still want to wait like five years I guess four and a half now um you know so I really get over myself <laughs> but we'll talk about that later um let's have a good time Look at my chubby what are you up to I'm making a thumbnail <laughs> So we just filmed a Truth or Dare video. Here's the thumbnail, a little sneak peek. There you go. Um, and that'll be on the Couples... <laughs> anyway, that'll be on the Couples channel tomorrow when you're watching this. So go subscribe. I always have it in the description. Uh, our Couples channel is actually really fun. And Dallin edits videos way better than me. If you like <laughs> funny stuff, go watch that channel. So I think our plan is that we are gonna get ready and then go to dinner somewhere nearby and I also want to go to the gift shop and get like cute shirts I love t-shirts and I've just like realized that my style is forever no matter how hard I want to dress cute that made no sense I will forever wear big t-shirts so I'm just gonna go buy a cute t-shirt I'm ready for dinner now I was still in my swimsuit so I changed into like actual underwear and put on some shoes and socks I'm wearing spandex so I'm not just wearing no pants by the way Husband That's looks good. so cute. He's oh, wearing nice. some Lululemons, and yeah, let's go. I'm actually, like starving. Also, I've been craving shrimp. So, I mean, I'm gonna guess the restaurant we're going to has shrimp, considering we are by the beach. Most restaurants are gonna serve seafood, yeah. so I'm really excited to eat some shrimp. This is the only elevator, and it takes so long. It takes literally like 20 years. And there's only five levels. So why does it take so long? It's the slowest elevator ever. So annoying. On our way. Hey, don't be tired. Drink this. <laughs> I'm driving. <laughs> oh my goodness. So we're eating at a place called Poseidon, which means there's a, probably gonna be shrimp and I'm really excited. <laughs> and it looks really cute. There's like outside seating, like upstairs and downstairs. It looks really cute and I'm so excited. I'm so hungry. Just drove around for like five minutes trying to find parking. We ended up parking like way back here. It's like a shopping center and then there's the restaurant, but it's okay. It's a nice out and why not? Why not? Our names are on the list. The hour, wait. <laughs> <laughs> yes. The wait is an hour, so we have some time to kill, but that's okay because it's really nice out and there's like all this like cute little park area by the water. Oh, so yes. we're just gonna go on a little walk and stuff. Also, as soon as we walked out after putting our names on the list, there was an open spot At the very right front. in front of the door. And I was like, of course, of course there is. View with a view. Oh. This is the marsh. I don't think alligators go in here. Do they? I don't know. I don't know either. It, wait, is the marsh salt water or is it just like normal water? I think it's salt water. Then I don't think alligators go in salt oh, water. Oh, uh, good point. <laughs> Comment down below, answer our questions, we don't know. So we came to the realization that on this trip, I've gotten pictures taken every day, and I have so many pictures, but Dallin has zero pictures. Only ones with me that I've like set up a timer. Yeah. So we're gonna take some like cute that. pics of him. Wow, that was my I face. did not mean to do that, but it works.
So Dallin, what are we about to watch? Google, on my Google Photos has made me a video called Meow Movie. Okay. Just, just watch. Right. Wait, 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 okay. Turn it up. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. He's so mad. Ah! Why did Google just randomly do this? I don't know. <laughs> this is amazing. All right, we are sat and we are going to enjoy our meal. So it started raining. So while we're eating, um, it started raining. Luckily, we didn't get wet where we were sitting, even though we were outside. But Dom, we got the car for me. How I know. Nice. I had to go do a sprint Aww. after that all that seafood in my tub. We are back. Here's the shirt that I got. I love it a lot. The back is so cute. I love this color too. Big t-shirts, definitely my vibe. I also got some stickers so I can add it to my water bottles. Okay, wait. I gotta think about this. I'll just do it like right there. Boop. Cute. I love that sticker. That's so cute. Earlier, I filmed the part about me having the dreaded baby fever. So cue to sit earlier. Okay, Dallin's going to the bathroom, so now is a better time than ever to talk about what this video is about. Baby fever. It's a thing, I have it, and it's bad. Like, I, I hate having it, is the thing. I've always wanted to be a mom. Ever since I was like a little girl, all I ever wanted to do was be a mom. People used to ask me what I wanted to be when I grow up, and I'd literally say, I want to be a stay-at-home mom. <laughs> but now, I'm married, so it's like, I'm in the situation where I could have a kid. And I feel like, I'm not ready to have a kid, but I have all the points that people feel like they need to have kids. You know, I have a house, I have a husband, and just I feel like my life is like, okay, you could totally have a kid right now and it would work with your life. Like it wouldn't change my life dramatically, you know? And so my little woman brain wanting me to have babies is just like, let's have babies. But no, I, but I don't want them, you know? And so I'm just talking about the real truth of having baby fever, because it happens. The first time I really got baby fever was like three months into our marriage, and my sister-in-law just had a baby in September, and my other sister-in-law had a baby in December. So I've watched both these babies literally grow from in the womb to now a couple months old, you know? And it's so cute. But here's the thing, cause like, you would think, oh, being around the baby would make you annoyed, or well, once they're toddlers, they're annoying. But I also love hanging out with my nieces and nephews who are like little kids, and I can't wait to have my own, and I wanna have a little Sydney running around and a little Dallin running around, and we already have a couple names picked out, and I just like, am so excited for that next chapter of my life. But I definitely don't wanna rush into things, and that's why I'm saying that, and just admitting to it, like. I I do have baby feet, but I'm not going to have kids. If it happens on accident, like that's the thing. I'll be really happy about it, honestly. But I don't, I don't actually want them. I feel like I just like the idea of having a baby, the idea of being pregnant. Like, oh my gosh, this is so bad. But whenever I have baby fever, I watch videos about pregnant people. I literally binge watch them. I think I've watched like a thousand finding out I'm pregnant and telling my husband videos. I have a list in my notes of how I'm gonna tell my husband, my mom, my dad, my in-laws. Just, I have all these cute ideas, which will come in handy when I actually do get pregnant. But, that's like four and a half years away from what we're planning. And it's just like, why am I doing this to myself? I really don't know. But I think the good thing is that my husband, Dallin, doesn't want to have kids right now. He definitely wants to wait. I know he's excited about having kids, but he humbles me and says, Sydney, you are 19. You do not want to have a child. And I'm like, okay, yeah, you're right. Because in the reality of things, like, I still want to travel. I want to, you know, be able to just live my life, you know, my husband on a deep, deep, deep level. Have our relationship be so strong. Because the truth is, once you have a baby, it completely switches up the dynamic. You can't, like, do what you did when you were just a couple. Now you have this baby that you have to take care of. And it's a literal lifelong commitment. Am I ready for that? No. Do I like the idea of being pregnant, having a baby, all that? Yes. But I also 
also am aware that babies cry and kids are annoying sometimes. I feel like baby fever for me is just loving the idea and maybe even the fact that you get a lot of attention when you're pregnant and have a baby. So that's what makes me like kind of just like, oh, I hope I'm pregnant right now. Yeah, I just thought it'd be funny to like let you guys know what's going through my head because at the end of the day, no, I don't want a kid. I really don't want to be pregnant right now. You know, it's just fun to think of it and it's kind of fun to have baby fever sometimes. But you know, like I said, I'm only 19 and the earliest I'd ever even want to actually consider having a kid would probably be like 21, 22. And I know Dallin is not going to be ready by then. Um, he's kind of been scared of kids his whole life and babies and stuff. So yeah, when I'm 24, I feel like that'll be a really good time to reevaluate and decide where I'm at in life. But oh my gosh, baby fever is so real. Why is it such a thing? Why? I don't know. I literally annoy Dallin and be like, oh my gosh, just think about having a little Sydney or a little Dallin just running around. But yeah, I don't know. Those are just things that pop into my head. I know that the time's not right and I definitely don't want to pressure my husband into it or even like pressure myself into it. And I want us to both feel like we're ready or at least wait a little bit. I want to get to know each other. You know, I want to travel, have fun, at least for the next like three years. But we'll see. Maybe in a year we'll change our minds. No. Okay. Don't do that to myself. Okay. Nope. It's fine. I'm just going through baby fever right now, and that's why I'm like, ah, I want to have a baby. Oh my gosh. I can't wait for myself to look back on this when I am pregnant and I'm like, oh, I was so young. What was I thinking? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, yeah. So that's that's pretty much it i just wanted to sit down and talk with you guys about sometimes i just really want to have a baby but that's just like surface level deep down i am not ready i think if i actually were to find out i'm pregnant right now i would be very very anxious very scared and completely like in shock and wouldn't know what to do really i'm gonna take my time and hopefully my baby fever will suppress i don't even know why i like have it like, i'm just excited to be married why am I wanting babies? It's so annoying. Okay, whatever, I'm over it. That's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give us a thumbs up. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. You know how many channels I watch and forget to subscribe to? Like, it's real. So don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.